Yeah, but it's six o'clock in the morning, getting her exercising in. Okay, 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 okay. What's good with y'all, man? It's your boy, John. Traversy and I'm back with another video for y'all. So today we are going to be talking about some scams in Pattaya and some things that you might want to avoid when you come on your trip out here if you're planning on coming. So, so we're going to head down to Beach Road. I'm going to get a haircut and I'm going to also share with you guys some of these tips. So let's go. Alright, so we are now at Pattaya Beach and this might be one of your first stops if you like to be by the beach and chill and this is the main beach in the city and while we're here we're going to talk about the first thing that you should be on the lookout for. If you look on the background you will see they have jet skis and boats and all types of stuff now when you are coming here if you are going to deal with these jet skis what you want to do is you want to make sure you record the whole jet ski record around kind of like how it is when you're renting a car you want to record everything because there are times where people will act like you messed up their jet ski and you got to pay for it or buy a new one and when you didn't do anything wrong so make sure you have documentation of how it looked before you took it out that way nobody can make anything up when you finish so that's gonna be number one the jet skis got me feeling like crying cause you always rush it rush it stressed over nothing so stressed over nothing your mind has been filled with traffic no stop signs stuck on bad Another thing that we are going to talk about is the ATM. So out here, when you are using the ATM, you have to remember that your card comes out after everything else. So in the States, usually when you use the ATM, the card comes out first and then they give you the money. But in Thailand, your money comes out first, your receipt comes out, and then your card comes out. So a lot of times you might just leave and forget the fact that your card is still in the machine. So that's one thing you definitely want to be aware of when you are using the ATMs in Pattaya. Because last thing you want to do is leave your card in the ATM machine. And the same concept as the jet skis can be applied to these bad boys. So if you are going to rent a motorbike while you are in Pattaya, make sure that you record everything as well, just like on the jet skis. Because last thing you want to do is rent a bike and people tell you that you messed it up when there was already something messed up with it to begin with. So. Just like the jet skis, if you will be renting a motorbike while you are in Pattaya, make sure to record and get all damages on file before you leave with it. So that's another one. If you're gonna drive a motorbike, just know that there are police checkpoints as well. And they're set up all throughout town at different times. So if you aren't wearing a helmet and you don't have a license, then you can be stopped. Now, it's not really necessary for you to have a license to rent a motorbike, but if you don't have one and you run into a police checkpoint, you will be coming out of pocket for that as well. I'm on the sound, who do you see? Some back around, no more summer bounce, little squeeze out, squeeze. See the indoors when we're falling down. Oversized jumper with her underwear out. Like they're bringing anything to the table. Bro, I'm not your son, see I'm able, I do my own bits. Limited edition, no some missing classic shit. I know that you're feeling it. 
first time, I'm proud of my selfish decisions. Couple people did me dirty, but I'm clean. Ain't even mad proof, karma is a B. So as you may know, Pattaya is known for his bars and nightlife activities, and that's gonna be the next one on the list. So sometimes when you go to these bars, there might be one or two drinks that's on your bill that you did not order. So there is some bill padding that may happen out here sometimes. So the way that they give you drinks out here is they give you your drink and then they give you a bill which sits on your table. And then every time you order a drink, they add a drink to that bill and so on and so on. So that can get tricky because if you're drinking and you get a little drunk, then you might lose track of the drinks that you bought. So you might look and there might be one or two extra drinks on your bill that you didn't order. So to avoid that, you can either pay as soon as you finish with each drink, you can pay, or you could just be cognizant of what you ordered. That way you don't get ripped off. So that's going to be a major thing to look out for when you are in Pattaya is the bill pad. And last but not least, now this may not necessarily be a scam, but it's more like misinformation and it pertains to the transportation when you come out here to Pattaya. So, so there will be motorbike taxis and regular car taxis. Now motorbike taxis are usually the easiest way to get around because of the fact that there's usually traffic and they can kind of go in and out of the cut. So that will be your best bet of getting around, but you could choose either way. Now, when you are trying to get these transportation options, if you just walk up to them on the street and ask them a price, nine times out of 10, you're gonna get double the price that it should be. So I would suggest you use an app called Bolt or Grab. Those two apps are great for transportation, basically like Uber in Thailand. So if you use those, you will get a way better price. And you will even notice that sometimes, say that you talk to a motorbike driver and he says one price you might go on a bolt app and order a bolt and that same guy might take your ride and it's going to be half the price that is another thing to be on the lookout for when you come in here as far as transportation download bolt or grab in order to get your rides to and from wherever you want to go because getting them on the street you're going to pay double not too many scams and stuff are going on here most of the things are just things that being mindful and paying attention will solve. So when you come here, just make sure you're on your toes and you're paying attention to everything and you will be all right. Your day in the sunset showing you guys many Pattaya events lately because I'm not usually here but there is a bowling event going on today hosted by the Golden Tiger Tree Time Players Club and we're gonna go and check this out My brother Dante in the building, man. Oh, man, happy Juneteenth to us, man. We out here at the bowling event. Okay. It is a really, really nice and spectacular event. Um, glad to travel virtually to make it out here, him and this lady, and we all enjoying ourselves, man. Happy belated Father's Day to all the fathers out there. Hey, we out here, we having fun. Yeah. What made you want to do a uh, bowling event for Juneteenth? So, um, it was actually sort of between myself and uh, Fish for Tree Time, okay. and then we messed around and we wanted to include everybody as we could you know we just wanted to bring something together for all of us to make sure you know what i'm saying we come together right. collaborate right. and just continue to build and build between each other okay 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 man definitely a great turnout man and appreciate you as always man for bringing everybody together and you know doing your thing so y'all go to golden tiger bar too by the way now we got my brother fish from tree time in the building man this is for all your ganja needs this brother has a nice establishment rooftop bar all that how have you been out here in thailand so far been out here on three and a half years three and a half years okay so uh what made you get into the industry of cannabis and all that i just happened to be here and 
they started letting things go, like the leaf and edible first two years ago, and then last year they added the flower into it, yeah. and then we just go from there. What somebody expect when they come to tree time, and uh, what kind of environment is it over there? It's a nice fun environment, you know, depending on we've got party stuff going on, otherwise, you know, my wife is up there, they crazy women <laughs> yeah. out here, get you drunk, get you. <laughs> right. My nigga. <laughs> right, right. You know, just have a good time. You just did a barbecue, right? Yes, sir. Is that something that you're going to continue to do, stuff like that? Is that something that you do usually? Yeah, we're going to try to have some more barbecues and stuff going on. And then also have, like, private rentals. People want to have private parties and okay. stuff upstairs. We'll okay. have, it, have it available for that, too. Okay, okay. Yeah. So y'all definitely go check out my brother Fish at Tree Time, man. He is doing his thing out here, man. And definitely support this brother when you come for all your ganja needs and pataya. So I appreciate you, man. Hey, let's sir. Lucky out of bowl. Oh, Lord. You can do it? Oh, you waiting for your turn? Going all to different places, different planets Got your aura past me by losing balance What if we were out of time and second chances? Empty-handed Alright, so we are back inside Hope you guys enjoyed the video Hope you guys learned something from the video Definitely give this a thumbs up, man Try to get it to a thousand likes, so Run the likes up. We trying to get the 30K subscribers. That is coming up soon. So hit that subscribe button if you are not subscribed. And this next week is probably going to be some of the most meaningful videos I've posted on this channel to me. So you guys definitely stay tuned for that because it's going to be special, man. Like, comment, subscribe as always. Appreciate you, man. And I'll catch you on the next one. Overseas, couple G's and expenses. Gotta get it, I've been different since the entrance